I first started um, really wanting to be an artist when I was a uh, lumberjack in the 1970s working uh, north of uh, Lake Superior and I used to see the sun going down in the forests and all kinds of beautiful things and sunsets and just being immersed in nature all the time every day and uh, I got a real appreciation for it so I thought I would uh, become an artist and try and um, show the, the world I guess what how I feel about nature and how what I see in nature and how I can show that in my artwork. Because I'm self-taught I had to kind of study great masters and, and try to understand how they painted what they painted and that's how I taught myself to paint. I was inspired by the moodiness and light that uh, Monet was able to capture in a lot of his paintings. That, that was a very big inspiration of me. I suppose now I'm inspired by, um, by emotion that you can get from looking at uh, a subject, whether it be um, a water or a forest or a sunset. I used to go painting out a lot and then I would bring paintings back and need to work on them and finish them. And I didn't have anywhere to do it. so. Um, I had this property and I had an opportunity to build this building. I built it all out of uh, trees I cut myself and a lot out of recycled wood. I think my, my ambition as an artist would be to be a lot, do a lot more um, on-site, outside uh, painting. Um, sort of go back full circle to where I started perhaps. <laughs>